Kenneth was an extremely sick patient here, and because he was such a fighter, he ultimately left the hospital, and it took a lot of care and team effort to accomplish that. He met all the requirements to be placed on ECMO. He had a one in four chance and mortality rate. Um, he said that if, he, if I agreed to do the ECMO, then the ECMO would give him a 50% chance. These are critically ill patients already in an ICU on a mechanical ventilator. So we perform the function of the lungs and also in certain circumstances, the function of the heart as well so that your body can recover. This is potentially life-saving and that is the reason that we would do it. At one point, obviously the sickest patient in the hospital uh, requiring a lot of resources and just going from that to being, you know, at home from being the sickest patient in the hospital, he's they don't make him any tougher than him. I mean, he's, a, he's our Superman. It was my pride and honor to see you being from so sick and get better and get home. This is my family. I am so thankful to every last one of them. While the medical care team takes care of the physical needs of the patients, we take care of the family members, uh, the patient's spiritual needs, and any of the staff's spiritual needs as well. A blessing to still be here. Um, I was thankful I was in the right place at the right time to get this great care from this great staff and I was able to save my life. I mean, I can't, can't thank them enough.